hello everyone welcome again and uh, in this video i'm going to show you one more project and java uh, exactly java web project and in this project i'm using uh, it's a timetable management system for uh, the college uh, college faculties or uh, college or institute and institute you can use that and uh, it will for learning purpose and that will for that uh, uh, college student who are going to submit their minor or major project so they can use it for learning purpose how to create a project in Java and how to um, use that MBCs and Maven tools and the proper uh, way of uh, real time projects how projects is going to work so uh, here is the complete post at code1.com you can visit here and uh, check the description complete description of the uh, project and uh, so timetable project uh, timetable management project in java so there is some modules are that like time timetable inside the timetable admin can add a new timetable or can can we view uh, or user or other uh, admin also can view that existing timetable and subject inside the subject admin can add a new subject and view the complete list of subjects and sim similarly five four faculties there is another uh, module inside this module admin can add a new facility faculty and um, or view complete list of other faculties and some common packages common pages like contact us about us and home okay so here is a video demo video you can view the click on this link uh, click on this button and view the demo how it will work and these are the configuration which is required to you like uh, which kind of database you need to do new you need to do configure like mysql database and languages are used simple jsp servlet css and js and javascript and server is a tomcat tool configuration tool is a maven and id is a spring sts tool or you can use eclipse also and okay so I'm going to uh, it is my ID and uh, STS tool inside the timetable project you can see I configure the project in Maven and then I use the complete uh, MBC architecture so in M MBC architecture there will be some bean classes there will be some control classes to control the uh, con uh, con to control the flow control flow and uh, this is called controller basically and model and business classes i combine the business and model classes inside the model package and uh, so finally i'm going to run this and for running purpose just right click on the project and click on run and uh, select a server and which server you are going to run this so i'm going to use tomcat server so you can click on tomcat and click next and finish now you need to wait uh, server is going to start and uh, need to wait a second it will launch a browser and project will be launched automatic okay so it's my home page and when user will click on the timetable management system then the next pages will come, will come and welcome to the timetable management first of all you need to log in here so for login purpose for login purpose before login you need to register here to sign up so sign up i'm going to show you the demo demo 3 as my demo 3 is name <coughs> the last name also demo 3 and uh, before that i need to start my uh, database so i'm going to use workbench as usual all project in all project i use it and uh, enter the email id demo3 at the rate gmail.com and enter the password 12345 and enter the mobile number 23456789 like this and uh, to wait to launch that database okay so database is here and i'm just going to start a server database server and it's root and that's done so inside the browser i'm going to submit 
click on submit and when I click on submit the data is successfully saved just remember the first name and our email id or password that is gmail.com and I'm going to log in this so demo3 at the rate gmail.com 12345 will be the password and click on the sign in and uh, like something going wrong okay uh, so successfully log in you can see the logout button is appear and inside the timetable menu you can list a uh, uh, timetable and uh, check the timetables um, according to the time time will be generated randomly and subject or time will be the one hour time and subject will be generated randomly according to the device and if you want to add some new timetables you click on add and select uh, faculty name any and select the subject and click on submit so that uh, subject will be appear in this uh, uh, time table and next so everyone rates list of subjects so you can check the existing subject and if you want to add some more subjects so like you need to enter a subject code like seven eight uh, to enter subject name first so subject name is advanced java and if you are going to enter some uh, uh, enter subject code so we can say one two three four five and submit and now you can view that subject sorry inside this subject view subject list and advanced java one two three four five and uh, now if you can see the faculty list so faculty list here if you want to add some more faculty you can enter the faculty name like uh, john doy john doy and enter the department name like csca or something so i'm going to see a computer application and inside this you can see the faculty john doy is inserted so this and next this is contact form and about us and home i'm not inserting any um, page here you can change this you can change it it's easily link here and finally i'm going to log out so it is a complete project and <coughs> and uh, you need to uh, if you wanted the source code source code i will provide in a description box and you can check the link and download the source code and configure in your machine if you got any problem if you get any problem you just uh, comment to me i will try to solve the problem and uh, uh, for that uh, I'm not using any uh, other APIs or other libraries, just I'm going to use that Maven tool. If you don't know how to use Maven tool, please, can, uh, please comment me. I will try to make one more video to configure the project, how to configure it uh, at your machine. And if you want to change some designing, you can uh, edit this CSS and you can insert some images inside the image folder. Inside the JS, you can insert some JavaScript files inside this JSP and this is my main home file and uh, it's a following that complete mpc architecture if you get any trouble just learn first uh, how to use that mpc architecture in java and how to create this kind of project and then you can easily configure and uh, if you want to add something or edit something you can edit this uh, pages and there is a meaningful name you will easily understand what is the meaning of welcome.jsp user register.jsp if you want to relate, change some relate information you can do that and if you got any trouble to configure please comment to me i will try to solve and any kind of project you have, if you need uh, and any kind of video required related to java technology you can suggest me thank you